Twitter in turmoil just a week after Elon Musk completed his $44 billion purchase of the social media giant. Potentially thousands of employees at Twitter today opening their devices to learn that they no longer have a job. Mass layoffs are expected across the company. If you're going to police content less, if you're going to moderate content less, you don't need, need as many staff to do that. It's also a function of what he needs to do, however, because he massively overpaid for this company. In response, several employees have filed a class action lawsuit alleging that Twitter is in violation of the WARN Act, which requires an employer with 100 or more employees to provide 60 days advance written notice prior to a mass layoff. There are certain exceptions that would exempt a company from making those types of specific notices. This while a number of major corporations such as General Mills, General Motors and Audi have paused their ads after Musk's takeover and reports of a surge in racist comments and hate speech on the platform. Advertisers are already really freaked out about what this platform will look like in the world of less content moderation. They don't want their logos alongside anti-Semitic tweets or, you know, neo-Nazi content. Musk responding to the moves with a tweet saying he has seen a massive drop in revenue, which he blamed on activist groups pressuring advertisers, even though he says nothing has changed with content moderation. To generate revenue, Musk may charge $8 a month for Twitter's subscription service called Twitter Blue, the coveted checkmark to verify an account, among other features. I'm Mike Valerio reporting.